have one called Magic Move, which is up here. Magic Move is pretty cool. This is what happens with Magic Move. I've already got it set to Magic Move. Let's go ahead and hit play. And it automatically happens. So I just transitioned from one slide to another. And I said that the transitions are the only link between the two slides. Well, this Magic Move lets you link an item on this page, or in this slide, to an item here. So basically, it has to be the same item. If it's not the same item, it's not going to do a magic move for you. So what I've done is I've just taken this logo. All right, so let's just take that logo here. And I make sure that that logo, I usually copy and paste, actually appears here. Now the nice thing is it knows that it was, it's the same item, right? So it says this item is the same as that item. Now I tell it to do a magic move from this slide. So I do transition, magic move. Choose the duration. It is going to tell you that you need to make sure you have at least one object in a different location. All right, so say OK. And I'm going to go ahead and tell it to do it automatically. And let's actually do a delay so it actually sits there for a second. All right, so we'll say OK. And then that item just moves that way. And the cool thing is that thing can keep moving around from slide to slide. I've done that just to create an animation. So if I didn't have this here at all, let's delete this that's here. I could just do an animation that says, let's do a transition. And we'll go ahead and have no delay. We'll do another one here. And then we'll copy this. And we'll create a whole new slide. And let's put it here. I'm going to delete both of these. Or I can uncheck it from the slide <coughs> inspector. And let's paste that here. And then let's actually go ahead and rotate this. Put it here. And let's actually scale it down as well. And just move it down here. Come back to this slide, and we need to tell it magic move for our transition. So let's do magic move. All right, so now we can just go ahead, oh, and we need to tell it automatically with no delay. So let's play that. We can just have that move around. We could have follow the bouncing ball, right? We can just have that go throughout.